this is our flower container. It currently does not have flour in it. We didn't have flour in it before we left. It's a canister. It's here in our cabinet, which Larry has already refused to replace anything in. I could tell somebody did do some cleaning around the edges, but there is some dust inside. We have a lot of food in here. Um, not everything needs to be replaced, but without a doubt, this flower bag here that's opened, um, we opened that. But I don't feel safe eating that flower considering that the dust from the construction likely got in here because this is far from airtight. We've got a lot of other stuff in here, some sugar, this, these, this brands of sugar that I buy, a lot of them, they have these, these little clasps that like a Ziploc bag, they close, but they don't close all the way. Um, and so that's why we use these bag clips. So it's far from airtight. So those need to be replaced. Some Dutch cocoa powder that I have open, so we can't use that. Some peanuts in there that were mostly gone, but still. So yeah, these lentils, you know, some of the stuff we just tape shot our rice. Again, this is all organic food. Larry did tell me verbally in response to my email that he was going to cover the counters, the cabinets, top and bottom, and he responded via uh, through because of my email that I wrote to him, and he was very obliging in our conversation. Down here we have our quinoa. Again, it's just one of these clasps that you know aren't completely airtight. Here's some spaghetti that we didn't use all of it, so we just you know taped it shut, but it's not airtight, so. What we're looking for, those are our bags and our lunch boxes. Again, I could tell that these have been cleaned by someone because I actually did have some food stains on my bag that are no longer there. So somebody went through and did some initial cleaning. Um, some of this stuff could be salvaged, obviously. We're not asking for our olive oil to be replaced and some of these other glass canisters, but the things that are open, we definitely deserve retribution for.